Welcome back to Horizon 4. Why am I in reverse? It's still night time. We're still on the beach. We're gonna do this drag, drag race. In our Rally Subaru. WRX STI. Better known as Hawkeye. Okay, it's not better known, but. Codename Hawkeye. That's what everyone calls it, at least. Um, this thing is fully built on drag's legs. Not that I think that would help on the surface, but. I grind everything. And across the line. Very hard indeed. Okay, <laughs> everyone's using a Subaru. Oh, that's when you know you've made it. Everyone's using the same car as you. Um. Okay. On. Oh, no. Hey, Maverick. Nice paint job. Why not show the artist some love with the rating? Like, sure, it's cool. It's it should like it should already be in the game. I asked like a option. What? Uh, look in the speedometer gauge thing. It actually has a trip counter. Which shows how much you've driven. Since, like, I've driven a total of 304 with this car, but 0.7 of those have been after, well, since the last race. I never noticed that in previous games. That's pretty cool. This has a trick counter. One more uh, race. I should have increased the difficulty. Hey, that's like. I grind every gear. Not there, though. And across the line. Okay, I need to turn up the difficulty in the drag racing, especially with this car, because this thing is a beast. It, like, just takes off, doesn't spin, it just goes. And yeah! Now I have the Ultima. The 1020. Which is supercharged LS. And another wheel spin. Cool. Give me something good. Hmm. Right, you're pretty well respected on the drag strip, but how about we take this further? All you have to do is finish this. The ultimate drag strip. An idea from me and my crew with consultation from our own Jay Shah. Win here, and you'll be a Horizon legend, underground and over. Underground and over? Hmm. This is the longest drag strip in the game. 200 yards. Turn left. Which I don't really want to call a drag strip. Turn left. Because it's not straight. In the slightest. Recalculating route. In 100 yards. Turn right. In 400 yards, turn left. Okay, I'll take that view spot later. In 100 yards, turn right. Sorry if you have like a big crack. I just had to mute my microphone because I just sneezed. Hopefully you didn't hear that. Mm. 
no, it doesn't turn. It has track sticks, so that makes sense. In 400 yards, turn left. I really want a Subaru as a winner car. Turn right. Turn right. That all was, I, yeah, I live in Norway, so it gets no win a winner, and my BMW is fun to drive, but it's not exactly the easiest thing to drive in the winter when it's snowy and slushy and yeah. At the roundabout, take the fourth exit. The juggernaut. I will have to change car. Um for this I kinda want to take the Agera. But it's kinda like I also don't want to do that. So, yeah. Could go like Ford GT. That has pretty high top speed, I think. Screw it. Let's go Ford GT. I haven't used this much. I drove around like two seconds and uh, the winter. Kind of wish the new Ford GT had a similar engine setup to this. Kind of wish the new GT had like a supercharged Voodoo. High revving supercharged motor with whine and scream and oh. Oof. Supercharger whine and the turbo takes off. Okay, let's do some drafting. He goes off. Can use that to my advantage. Drafting, drafting, drafting. Oh, okay, let's go around. Probably didn't have to lift, but this interior is so cool. It's so retro. <laughs> and across the line. Okay, I need to turn up the difficulty because drag races are kind of boring. I know if you're like an unbeatable, they they can kind of be hard. Like, I don't want to just easily win every race. I kind of want to have to fight a bit for it. Common track toys T, okay. Uh, am I, like, done with drag racing now? Just listen to the supercharger. A new car has been added to your garage. And I guess it's the Ultima. Which is technically, we could have used that in this race. Like, really light, a thousand horsepower. <laughs> Would probably be pretty good. So let's drive that down to the showcase, the Halo showcase. And, uh, yeah. Sounds kind of underwhelming, but the Halo, ex Halo experience. I'm just going to take the shortcut. Because this is Horizon. I can do whatever I want. 
this manual. Forgot about that. Also, the steering wheel is freaking in your face. Initializing UNSC training protocol 165FD. Cortana! Oh, that's awesome! And we drive the Warthog, which I've already driven in Horizon 3. Oh, you're dressed as Master Chief? Oh. Okay, that's awesome. Okay, th th this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. And you're dressed With as the ongoing Chief. and evolving threat posed by an increasingly focused covenant, all frontline UNSC personnel are expected to complete the following training exercise. Upon completion of the training exercise, please submit results to UNSC Fleetcom for assessment. Okay. Um, <laughs> this is pretty cool. What the heck is that? This is Kilo Actual. Cortana, do you read me? What? I heard you need a pickup. Cortana to Kilo Actual. Perfect timing. We're all done here and ready for dust off. Okay, this Whoa, is like. Pickups. Sorry, Cortana. I gotta shake these bogies. Affirmative, Kilo Actual. I'll scan for a new LZ. Chief, gun it. Get us out of here. Oh. Cortana. What is this place? I don't know. Looks like a fortification of some kind, but it hasn't been used in centuries. Is that a Spartan? We're gonna make it home after all! Okay, new LZ found. We don't have long. This ring is gonna go nuclear in three minutes, and we do not want to be here when it does. Hey, keep your head down! There's two of us in here now. Marines, I've added coordinates to your nav. Be there for evac in three minutes. Okay, this- that, Cortana! Hoorah! This is the best showcase ever. Dwellings. It almost looks like something lives here. Just go straight up here. We've got a better chance of avoiding those banshees off road. This is the coolest showcase ever. Hoorah! Hoorah! Whoa, banshees! Look out! Banshees inbound! Try and lose them through those trees! Banshees, fast and low. Banshee! Save us, Chief! This is Cortana to all air support units. I'm sending you coordinates for an LZ, requesting immediate evac. Repeat, all air support units to the LZ. Cortana, I'm getting a green from three, four, make that five pelicans. En route to the LZ. You and the Marines had better be there soon. Cortana, I can't follow you through there. I'll see you on the other side. That's not the most reassuring choice of words. This cave is not a natural formation. Woo! Echo! Something like this, comms have gone quiet. Kilo Actual, do you read? Kilo Actual. Whoa! It's loud and clear, Cortana. Good to see you again, pilot. I do not want to reach that LZ without you. Hoorah! I I'm speechless. 
I'm I'm freaking speechless. Cortana to all units. The LZ is right ahead. We have 30 seconds before the ring superstructure begins to collapse. Don't say I'm gonna hit it. Okay, I almost hit. I hit the plane. What? 15 seconds, Chief. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We're not gonna make it. Pilot, this would be a very good time to leave. Horizon Festival training module complete. Initiating upload of results to UNSC Fleetcom. Uh, uh, well, what happened? <laughs> okay, that was just insane. That was freaking insane. What? Why didn't they do something like this for freaking Horizon 3 when they added this car? Or vehicle, or whatever you want to call it. This was so awesome! In my experience, there's a certain amount of attrition in any cross-country competition. Mechanical faults, hazards of terrain, drivers who just weren't quick enough. Not you though, you're through to round two. Through to round two. I know, amazing accent. Do I get the Warthog from doing that? I don't think so. I'm sorry, Ultima. Can I buy the Warthog now? Cause like, I don't have it. All right. Um, yeah, uh, let's go there. I guess the fastest way is technically just to do this. Go to festival. It's the only way you can fast travel. <laughs> Until you buy the fast travel house, which I don't even know where it is, but yeah, still. <sighs> okay, that was the best showcase they have ever done. I'm saying, I'm just saying it. It was the best showcase. Just period. Let's drive this beast. Just, yeah. Spare tire and everything. Um, can upgrade the engine. Give it 70 more horsepower. Huh. Well, let's keep it stock. Except intake, exhaust, and camshafts. And lightweight flywheel. Just like a slight upgrade, you know? Just slightly. Okay, it's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot, I know, but like, just makes it more fun to drive. Um. That's, that's pretty, pretty fast. Let's go get the summer th thing. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Or fine. This thing is fast. Turn right. Turn right. I know it's a group B car, but I 
what? It's left hand drive. Twenty two pounds of boost stock. And it sounds pretty good for a four cylinder. It sounds pretty good for, pretty amazing for a four cylinder. But race engine that goes to 9500 RPM. It's kind of. Haha, <laughs> found it. I'm just that good, apparently. Found it? Yes. Nice. Let me put on a dry shirt and I'll be there. Oh, it's the PLP 50. <sighs> Wait, it can't be. That's a PLP 50. I've wanted one of these ever since, ever since I was small enough to fit in one of these. Come on, help me lift it. Lift it. <laughs> oh, because you could. You could actually just lift it, throw it, in it a back of the garage it. and call you soon. Throw it into a back, into the back of a truck. Hey, Maverick. The good news is I put your name forward for our next showcase event. The bad news is, well, there isn't any bad news really. Meet you at the starting line. Mm, that will have to wait, because I want to get some barn finds. But first, let's do some wheel spins, because I need more money. Please. Money or amazing cars. Uh, okay, 75, 75k. That's okay. I'll gladly take it. Oh. Okay, a face. Come on, give me like a... Um, I don't know. Okay, um... I guess I should have come. <laughs> I guess I should have come up with something. This thing handles great. Even though it's built in the eighties. Turn around. Found it. It is safe to do so. No torque for the turbo. Race engine. Yay. Come you on. found it? Yes. Nice. The Redditors were right. I'll be there as quick as I can. Oh, it's a Quattro. It's a Sport Quattro. Wicked. With a cop light. Audi like... Sport Quattro. With a siren and everything. What? People are saying this belonged to. Wait, in the door are those bullet holes? Um... Uh, explain later. Right now, let's get this to the garage. Yeah, please. <laughs> those are bullet holes. Uh, okay. Just lock that barn up and all right, call you soon. Listen to that, like hundred and eighty, and then the boost kicks in and then Okay. Then it starts to pull. But doesn't pull before it hits boost basically. Um Ow. In 200 yards, turn left. Turn I'm a rally right. driver. In 100 yards, turn right. I would have died. I can drive this thing. In 400 yards, turn sharp left. Aha! 
It's in the doghouse. Sorry, dog. Hope you're not in there. Tell me if you see something. I've only gotten one seasonal bar find. And it's... I feel like it would make sense if it's here. But... I am actually completely lost. Because that's not there. It wouldn't be in a hill. I'm just slightly mad. You know what, uh, I'll end the episode here, then look on my own and see what I find. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, like and subscribe and hit the bell to get notified whenever I upload and uh, I will see you guys next time with some more Horizon 4. Goodbye. <laughs>